Namaste Green Weave, it's Miss Amy. Today I'm gonna to share with you what I like to call Namaste on the couch and stretch. So first we're gonna move our spine in six directions, all right? So with your feet on the ground, you can have your hands in your lap and we're gonna start with seated cat cows. So as you breathe and you open up your heart and breathe out around your spine, tuck your chin to your chest, that's your cat. So breathe like you, move like you. Again, you can do these on your couch, at your kitchen table, wherever you are, where you're learning remotely or working on whatever, or at a Zoom meeting. And then as we come back to center, we're gonna stretch the sides of our body. So as you breathe in and reach your arms up to the sky, you're gonna do a seated candy cane, which could look like this, or reaching for your wrist, guide it over to the side, or bring your hand to the couch and breathe, reach and stretch. Feel a nice side body stretch. Take it back up to center and reach and stretch over to the other side. As you breathe, feel your peace, feel your kindness. Again, you could reach your arm out. And then as you come back to center, we're gonna add in the twist. So if you're sitting on a couch, you can use your one arm to reach for the back of the pillow. So I'm gonna take my left arm to my right knee, and I'm gonna take my right arm right behind me on my couch and look over my right shoulder as I breathe here. I'm gonna feel even more of an opening in my shoulder. And then I'm gonna come back through to center, take my right arm to my left knee, take my left arm, to the back of the couch and look over my left shoulder as I breathe in and breathe out. Again, rinsing out the body, twisting, and then I'm gonna come back to center. Our next pose is our seated pigeon pose. So I'm gonna take my ankle to knee. This is one way, flexing through your foot as you breathe in. You can also start to forward fold and using what you have. So for example, I'm on my couch with the pillows. I can stack pillows on my legs and then it makes it a little bit more cozier, a little bit more comfier. And then I can rest my head here. Maybe I'm watching my Netflix or whatever's on TV or you know, at a Zoom meeting, right? <laughs> and then I'm gonna slowly come back up and switch sides. So shake that side out. Take your other side, ankle to knee. Again, maybe this is where you start, or you can forward fold, or again, use what you have. If you don't have pillows, you could stack blankets, you could fold towels. Again, you can get really creative with using what you have with your household items. And then on our next breath, as we come back through to center, you can do a butterfly right on the couch. So again, taking the soles of your feet, you can flap your butterfly wings just like this. Again, using your pillows, you can take one pillow under one knee, one pillow on your other knee for a more restorative version of your butterfly, just like this. You wanna add in more shoulders, bring your hands to your shoulders as you make some circles with your elbows. And then we're gonna slowly come back through to center. I'm just gonna move the pillows. Another way you can stretch, if you have the whole couch to yourself, breathe, reach and stretch, one foot out, one foot in, reach those arms up, breathe, reach and stretch to your toe, ankle, shin. And again, this is kind of like a half rainbow. If you wanna get creative, you can prop your foot up onto a pillow. All right. And then to add to it, to make it into a stargazer again, just moving the props so you have space. You're gonna swivel up onto your knee, bring one hand to the ground, breathe, reach and stretch your other arm up to the sky. And then you can play with it. You can lift your one foot up. Again, since you're on the couch, you have the support behind you. You can also relax just like this. Good job, everyone. And then we'll come back down. One more pose to do. One of my favorites, jellyfish pose. And once again, stacking the pillows to create your very own wall. You're going to make that waterfall, that jellyfish, by coming as close as you can to the pillows, resting your feet on the pillows and relaxing here. If you didn't have the pillows, you could rest your feet right on the armrest of your couch, just like this. It elevates your feet as well for a little relaxation. And then 
you can slowly come back through to center. And that's what I like to call namaste on my couch and do yoga.